if you come across a bright red salmon in the Strawberry River, it can only mean one thing. It's time to spawn. Uh, the females will select for the males that have the brightest colors and the, the, uh, the biggest humps on the back and things like that. So there is some selection there. Strawberry Reservoir has a high population of Kokoni salmon, even though they are rare in the state of Utah. There's a lot of cool things in nature, but uh, the fact that these fish um, are able to just sense their way to come back, that they are really giving their lives for this, that this is life or death for them. Other species survive after spawning, but for kokanee salmon, it's one and done. And so when they come up into these streams to spawn, uh, they, they, they basically they're saying, you know, the future is dependent on all these kids. I mean, on all those those eggs that they're laying. They're just such cool looking fish that that you got to come check it out. The trap facility behind the visitor center helps Mother Nature along by fertilizing kokanee eggs. They then go to the hatchery and eventually return to the Strawberry River the following spring. At Strawberry Reservoir, Christine Wallach, 11 News.